Hoop Angel Center, Sir Sammy, Static RJ Damien. He was good. We are back for another special. Yes. Today we are watching it for the very first time. I don't care if you don't believe that I've never seen this movie. It is what it is, all right? I don't know what to expect. I'm going to this completely blind. I know that it's a clown, but I mean, that could honestly be the story of my life. So I don't know, we're gonna find out. It's a horror movie. It's two hours long, I do know that. This movie is long as hell. So, I mean, there gotta be multiple deaths in this. I'm assuming, I hope. Anyways, if you're currently watching this premiere, how you doing, how you looking, how you smelling? I hope you're doing, looking, and smelling great. And if you didn't know, excuse me, I'm speaking. So no, I won't stop talking, all right? This is a commentary. If you didn't know. All right, I appreciate everybody that's currently in the chat. Go ahead and spam with the chat real quick with some hearts. We need some positivity, especially this Spooktober, because these movies have been off the hook. All of them. Anyways, we're not gonna do too much talking. We're gonna find out what it is all about. Thank you to GlassesUSA.com for sponsoring this video. So for all of my folks out there that do not wear glasses, y'all don't understand the struggle of finding a good pair and one that looks good and fits your face. So very important. By cutting out the middleman, GlassesUSA.com offers prescription glasses and sunglasses at up to 70% off retail prices. A complete pair of eyeglasses and sunglasses start at only $30. GlassesUSA.com has a virtual try-on tool, which makes it very easy for you to find the right pair. I even used it to find Mine and it was very helpful. I literally did this while sitting in this same exact spot. What makes it even better is I was able to get my glasses with my own prescription and with advanced blue light blocking lenses. For those that are not familiar with blue light glasses, they are ideal for protecting your eyes at work, home, or even outdoors. They also include glare prevention and UV block. Now how they have helped me is because I stare at a computer screen about 85% of my job is to decrease my headaches because I used to get frequent headaches and less eye strain. And honestly, I found myself to be a lot more productive. The selection on GlassesUSA.com is so wide they have over 9,000 styles of glasses and sunglasses that come in a variety of colors and even specialty glasses like sports goggles, safety glasses, kid glasses, and many more. I need you guys to be a judge out of the four glasses that I received. You guys tell me which one is your favorite. I'm gonna be honest with y'all, the ones that I'm currently wearing right now, these are my favorite. Okay, so here's the second pair. I normally only buy my glasses in black just because black is the same color, but it brings attention to my face and y'all know I'm all about attention all right so here's a third pair these are some sunglasses I'm not gonna hold you, you catch me in the grocery store you better watch your mama all right you better watch your aunties you better watch your grandmama cuz I'm, I'm liable to snatch them up you feel me <laughs> All right, so here's my fourth and final pair. I love them, you know? Like, I think they fit my face pretty good. Shopping online at GlassesUSA.com means a risk-free shopping experience. Free shipping and returns, 100% money back guarantee, full refund within 14 days of delivery, no questions asked, and a 365-day product warranty. You guys be sure to use the links that's in the description down below and also in the pinned comment. Once again, thank you to GlassesUSA.com for sponsoring this video. Now let's get back into today's commentary. See, I don't like this. We already got creepy baby noises and stuff. Uh, see, no. Normally when you hear a baby laughing, it's adorable. But when you hear it over some creepy lullaby music, this ain't it, Chief. This ain't it. That's disgusting. I'm gonna tell you how I know this movie already scary. For whatever reason, this kid got on a turtleneck pajama shirt. Where the hell do they even make those? I ain't never seen that before. This movie already scary. Oh no, I will call Big Bro. I'd be like, no, Big Bro, you gonna come down here with me. It's way too dark over there. Or at least tell your mom to turn the light on. Did she not pay the bill or something? Why is it so dark in that house? Oh, hell no, little Timothy, get up out of there. I wear glasses, it's too dark, I can't see. No, nope. I can't even, I can't see with these things on. Ain't no way. And the freaking light switch doesn't work. See, that's what I'm talking about. No, I'm not going down there. <laughs> I'm not going down there. Oh, man, what the? Really? See y'all, hell no, I'm not about to play with this movie. We already on that nonsense. Of course it was actually nothing, of course. Get out of there, little Timothy, get out. Thanks, Billy. Oh, his name is Billy? I missed that. It's because I was talking, I know. That's what y'all gonna say in the comment section. So what? I'm gonna keep talking. Y'all. Okay, so does their parents not pay attention to the kids? She got a son upstairs that's sick. The little boy is just literally running down the street right now. She didn't even know he opened the door. Like I said, I'm not one to judge anyone's parenting, but what the fuck, you know? Oh, damn, the little boy that knocked himself out with the sign. This is why he needs parental supervision because he's just running in the street. He ain't looking both ways or nothing. 
Oh, hell no. Nah. See, that's where it lives, huh? Hell no. Nah. Oh! <laughs> I didn't jump. You jumped. Shut up. <laughs> what the heck? Dude, I'm telling you. It's the headphones, man. It's the headphones. Sick. I bet I could cheer him up. Uh-uh. All I know is this clown better not be touching... That's what that's what I do know. It, it better only be a killer clown. Not that it makes it any better, but I'm just saying. So you're not gonna wonder why a kid is literally talking inside the... Really? Just selfish. That could be your kid. That could be your grandkid. There's peanuts. Cotton candy. Yeah, you better add something else with them peanuts. That's what I do know. Don't stop at nuts. That's what I'm saying. Like, this clown is really creepy. Take it, Georgie. George, don't take it. Oh, my gosh. What is he about to do to this boy? He gonna let him get it this time, and then he gonna come back and get him later. Oh! Ah! Oh! <laughs> what the heck? What the hell is... He took his arm off. He took his arm off. What the hell is it? There go George. Damn old lady was standing right there. I would call her my grandma, but she trash as hell. She knew it was a little boy just sitting there talking to, who, the, who you thought she was talking to, Santa Claus? Okay, so this isn't a scary movie for kids. It just has kids in it, right? This little girl's in there smoking. <laughs> Oh, you gotta kill them. You gotta kill them. Try tickling your pickle for the first time. <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> tickling the pickle. <laughs> I don't even... <laughs> this movie is heavy. We we literally 10 minutes in. Ditch, all decomposed, covered in worms and maggots, smelling like Eddie's mom's underwear. Shut up. <laughs> Why did he come for his mother? Oh, <laughs> Dang. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> Suck powers. Shut up, Bill. Nah, Billy said he had enough. Today's the day. I hope he I hope he registered his hands. I hope he did. This summer's gonna be a hurt train for you and your faggot friends. <laughs> Ain't no way, man! Ain't no freaking way. You should have uppercutted him as soon as he licked his hand. Bow! Is he trying to say that his brother might still be alive? Is that is that what the whole point of this is? He's dead! He's dead! Oh my goodness. Okay, come on, man. It's just a kid. Relax. First of all, where was you at anyways? He wouldn't be gone if he was in his life, you bum. He done made me mad. Yelling at Billy Moore. Next time you want to take something from my office, ask. How about I take this kitchen knife to the side of your ribs? How about I, ha! Ah, how about I do that, chump? Your poor excuse for it. Man, look. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. He had to yell at that boy. Shoot, him and his wife don't need to have kids. What the heck now I think about it? Where the heck was she at? She on a keyboard playing One Wish. <laughs> get out of, get on your bike. Get out of there now. The fuck out of my town! Man, all I know is I hope it comes for all them funny looking boys. I really do. <laughs> See, here we, no. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Nah, that ain't it, Chief. Public works with a public car. Was this the kid? This kid right here, was he the one in uh, Shazam? I don't, he looks familiar. Aren't you forgetting something? You better give your mom a hug and kiss. Don't believe me. Yeah, what I tell you? You never know. That could be your last time doing that. Always give your mom a hug and kiss. One for me too, Mrs. K? I was... uh, oh, he hilarious. He hilarious. <laughs> oh! What? It's creepy. Oh, no. Why would that be in a textbook? Oh! Man, this movie playing. This movie is playing. Bro, he ain't got no head. I would just automatically assume he can't see. Oh, sh What the? <laughs> what are you doing? I say, I don't know, Miss Doubtfire. It's a damn clown chasing me in a damn library. What do you mean, what am I doing? It looks like I'm running, doesn't it? Does it look like I run? Obviously, for a reason. <laughs> I just don't understand. Why are they bullying him? They are really cutting him. Oh, I hope these kids die. Oh, I hope they die. I really do. 
Man, I appreciate the fact that this kid had the heart to fight back, but I know that he's just gonna be bleeding all over the place. You use the same bathroom as your mother? Sometimes, yeah. Then you probably have crabs. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. I was wondering where he was going with asking that question. Why are they murdering this man like this? Like, that was really good though. Honestly, I loved it. Honestly. Oh, right now. I mean, have you ever heard of a Listeria? No! No! Don't, oh, you wanna talk about real scary? Yeah, don't, don't just fling stuff at me. On me, like I'm telling you, it's not too many things that'll make me act out of character. But play with me if you want to, for real. On YouTube, I'm laughy, smiley, all that good stuff. Play, play with me. Just play with me if you want to. See, there y'all go, investigating stuff you don't need to be investigating. And you by yourself too. No, I wouldn't be walking in no dark tunnel. What the hell be wrong with y'all, man? Oh, what the hell? First of all, how many? I thought it was just one clown. So does he have a whole posse full of people? Is that what he was talking about with the circus? I'm not gonna hold y'all. Watching these movies be killing my appetite. I can't even eat after I watch these movies. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, man. You look just like Clark Kent. Hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. You don't look nothing like Clark Kent. He looked like Ratatouille with glasses on. What do you think? Well, how about that? I think he's doing nine to five if he keep talking to you. That's what I think. More like who'd she do? For what I hear, the list is longer than my wang. That's not saying much. <laughs> what? <laughs> longer than my wang? Something weird about kids making penis jokes. Like what? Why don't you shut the fuck up, Einstein? Because I know what I'm doing and I do- Oh my goodness. Wow. These kids, <laughs> what? I still, don't, I still don't know how old they are. But let me not act like I wasn't cussing at a young age. But that don't mean to do it though. If there is any kids that's actually watching this video, I'm not saying that to do that. It's not cool, it's really not. I try not to in my videos, but sometimes it comes out, I can't help it. I'm actually, you know what? Moving forward, I'm going to do a better job of not cussing. That's gonna be really hard for these scary movies. But I'm going to go back to trying to be as clean as possible. The only word that I'm gonna give myself a little leeway for is, is hell, because like, hell no is like a, it's a go-to. It's my number one. This movie really has me all over the place. Oh my goodness, like, they don't let you breathe at all. First little Georgie, then we had little Pudgy. He getting harassed, bullied, freaking Chuck was about to kill him with the kitchen knife. She getting abused by her daddy. What more? What more? Who's first? Okay, I'm wondering why are y'all standing on this ledge in y'all underwear? That's what I want to know. So they really couldn't just put slum trunks on these kids? For real? Derry started as a beaver trapping camp. Still is, am I right, boys? Yeah, bro, you ain't funny. Come on, calm down with your stand up. There's somebody watching my videos that feel the same way. I know. I'm not gonna stop though. It's not gonna happen. My boys, the new kids on the block band. That's okay. They made some good music. I didn't listen to them myself. I just barely listened to them not too long ago on my second channel or my first channel, whatever. They made some pretty good songs. They was jamming too. See, here we go. No, man. At this point, we need to turn this, me saying no into a drinking game, honestly. And by drinking, I mean drink water because you know that's all I promote over here because I don't drink myself. But every time I say no or hell no, just go ahead and take a sip of water. Go ahead. <laughs> Out of all the places that you can run, you're gonna try to run behind this creepy house? So, is the balloons how many bodies he's caught? Is that how it works? Oh! Alright, looking at it, the blood looks fake. But at first... Ugh. That's, ugh, that's a lot of blood. Ugh. Why'd you do this to your hair? Makes you look like a boy. So you're just not gonna question all the blood on a... What be wrong with all of the parents in this movie? For real. Like, what? Every single one of them is trash. Every single one of them. <laughs> See, you, wait. What, is that his little brother? No, no way. 
Ain't no way. This fool standing in the corner with a smile on his face. That's not your little brother. That's a demon. Get out. Now this little girl be smoking like she work a full-time job. And she got three kids at the house. Like, she is stressed out by life at 16? 14? I don't even know how old she is. I need it. I... I need to show you something. Honestly, she looks like she can be that actress's daughter. What's her name? What's the actress name? Uh, Molly Ringworld. I think that's how you say her name. But she looked like, like that's her daughter. What happened in here? My dad couldn't see it. I thought I might be crazy. <laughs> well, if you're crazy, then we're all crazy. Wait, so your dad couldn't see this bloody room? Really? So is it only something that the kids can see? So is it a predator or what? I don't know. This... It's starting to seem less scary and more creepy. But I could be reading this completely wrong. I don't know. I wasn't the one scrubbing the bathroom floor and imagining that her sink went on Eddie's mom's vagina on Halloween. <laughs> Why does she keep going? <laughs> Why does he keep coming for people's parents? I'm not gonna lie. At first he was kind of annoying me, but I see a little bit of me in him. So I'm starting to like him a lot more is what I'm saying. Yeah. He's good. Wait, can only virgins see this stuff? Is that why I'm not seeing this shit? Here he go. <laughs> Here he go. <laughs> we know you a virgin, cause you talking too much, bro. You lying. That's how I know, cause I talk too much and I'm a virgin. <laughs> I mean, y'all really are acting like these rocks don't hurt. Like these are rocks. Go blow your dad, you mullet wearing asshole. <laughs> Oh, dang. I'm trying to get to me. I'm not gonna lie, this movie is kind of drawn out a little bit, you know? It's a lot of filler stories that I just don't care enough about, truth be told. I, 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 I can barely breathe. This is summer, we're kids. I can barely breathe, I'm up in a fucking- Bro, calm down. You just said you could barely breathe. How about you just take, take some time to yourself and breathe? Okay, I definitely saw that coming. 100% I saw that coming. So they're just hallucinating all of this, for real? Okay, so this movie is literally filled with jump, jump scares and hallucinations. That's it. All I see is that Georgie isn't there. His clothes, his toys, his... I mean, that's the reason why they can go on living their life, because they haven't lost their own Georgie. They can just continue doing whatever they was doing. Oh, even pulled a short straw. You guys are lucky you're not measuring dicks. Shut up, Richie. <laughs> Why is he always... What the heck? Like, what? <laughs> oh! <laughs> All these freaking jump scares, man. <laughs> yeah, that thing is beyond ugly, for real. Wait, why did you just fall back? Did you faint? I'm starting to think that these things don't have power outside of the sewer. Because every time they're out in real life, real life, they don't do anything besides just scare these kids. I wouldn't worry about it. Richie gonna stay alive because they don't do nothing but play with these kids. That's it. Beep, beep. Now, how funny would it be if he jumped up and he started like dancing and singing? That would have been great. I would have laughed hysterically then. So you mean that this kid was dreaming this? I told you, this movie is just an illusion. That's all this movie is. I get it now. It took me an hour and a half to get it, but I see. Okay, so if he don't kill at least one of these kids, I'm gonna be upset, cause what, what the hell is all this for? You just playing. Kill somebody at least. I'm starting to think George ain't dead. Beautiful fear. <laughs> okay, is it like Freddy Krueger where he feeds off of people's fear or children in this case? And that's where he gets his power because I'm just like, what? How the hell did they make two of these? We better get out of here! So y'all gonna holler, we better get out of here, but nobody's gonna move, huh? Nobody? Right. Now Billy is tough. A second ago, he was just... What? This movie is slowly becoming dumber and dumber. I mean, honestly, it might've started off dumb to begin with, but yo. I'm noticing it more now. And I don't want a dirty girl like you touching my son. It's funny that you should mention somebody being dirty. It's funny you say that. 
Ma'am, my dinner table would like its skirt back. Please. She got the nerve to have all that damn attitude with that cloth jumpsuit. Like, oh, trash fit. And look at this motherfucker. He's leaking hamburger helper. We can't. Hamburger helper. Oh, I love a good insult. No matter who's cut, no matter who's saying it, I love a great insult. Always makes you feel at home. I love it. This is what it wants. It wants to divide us. I mean, regardless of if y'all stay together or not, it doesn't really matter because y'all don't work well as a team. Separated. To me, at least three of y'all should have been dead by now. At least three. And that's me being generous because maybe five of y'all should have been out of here. Look at them now, boys. Ain't nothing like a little fear to make a paper man crumble. Wow, that's your son that you're talking about. Really? He gets bullied at home, so what does he do? He goes to school and bully other kids to try to make them feel as small as he feels. The cycle continues. What about the children? Oh, what about the children? Fuck them kids. Just kidding. <laughs> Now, don't tell me that he imagined this whole thing. Or did he really do it? Where are you sneaking off to? Oh, here we go. All right. Speaking of dads that should be killed. I know what's in boys' minds when they look at you. Baby. Man, I told you this dude was a creep. I told you he was. Please tell me you're going to stab him in the neck. Please. Are you still my girl? No. Ugh. Please, please kill him. Please kill him. Boys, do they know that you're my <laughs> This movie is so weird. Like, this whole movie is fascination with kids. <laughs> Whoa, yes. I don't think he's dead though. You just knocked him out. Hit him again. Stab him. Oh, shit. Now, ain't that a... You did this. Mm-hmm. You did this. Yup. I'm over this sick movie, man. <laughs> I'm over it. I'm over it! I'm sorry, but the only people that were actually trying to protect me were my friends. And you made me turn my back on them when I really needed them. So I'm going. That boy talked like a typewriter. Did you see that? He was and you by Mimic Drummer. Like all I seen was <laughs> the heck? Uh-oh. Avengers Unite! I know that's not the phrase, but I'm gonna say it just to piss some Marvel fans off if they're watching this. They're probably not. But I digest. If we split up at last time, that clown will kill us one by one. That clown had plenty of chances to kill y'all one by one. I doubt at this point it's gonna happen. Truth be told. What the hell is that? Are those hanging bodies? <laughs> if he doesn't kill one of these kids in the next five minutes, he's a pump faker. Honestly. No, 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 Get the roof, get the roof! Why did y'all just, come on, man, really? Y'all literally let him take this rope without no issue. Beverly! Oh, wow, he actually hung her. Okay. He killed one of them. Thank you. I mean, <laughs> that's gonna sound real bad. Real bad, but it is what it is, man. I'll come back for you, Beth. Oh, wait, she's not dead. She's just freaking stuck in a trance. I thought she was like being hung by a noose, but that's not it. She's still levitating, so he still ain't got a body. Beverly! Why isn't she waking up? Don't tell me that it's gonna be one of those like, she needs a true love's kiss to wake her up or some nonsense. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How'd I know? How did I freaking know? Predictable as heck and it didn't even do nothing. <gasps> really? Oh, hella late. You said I can have my boat back, Billy. Okay, is he all in his imagination? Cause, what? He's still the same age. Didn't they grow up or something? I miss you, I wanna be with mom and dad. For what, your mom and dad don't wanna be with you? That's why they let you run outside and fall into the sewer. 
I love you, Billy. I love you too. Now this is what Addison Ray thought she was doing and he's all that. Yep, yeah, it's a real moment right here. These are what we call actors. <laughs> that was actually gangster. I like it. Yeah, this movie is definitely more weird than it is scary. I'm positive I'd, if I didn't have these headphones on, those jump scares probably wouldn't even got me like that, honestly. <laughs> Why did you let him turn his head up immediately? As soon as he did all this, he would have went right back down. <laughs> as soon as he came up, bow, right back to sleep. Feast on your flesh as I feed on your fear. I mean, please, can you do something? Can you kill one of them, please? Jesus, like two hours, no deaths. The, pit, the humans are more scarier than it. You punched me in the face. Do we really have time for this speech? Like for real? <laughs> so while y'all just standing there watching, y'all could have easily been throwing weapons at him. It's more y'all than there is of him. So yeah, we could have did that about 30 minutes ago. Honestly, an hour ago. <laughs> Yeah, I figured towards the end of this movie is where it will start to lose its sting, you know, or steam, whatever. <laughs> Too bad you couldn't do your dad like that in real life, because I think he's still alive. I'm not 100% sure, but I don't think he's dead. So did they ever do like a backstory on where like it came from? I think that would be pretty interesting to see how this whole thing even came a thing. Fear. Okay, so are you guys actual IT fans or like what? What's the hype around this movie, honestly? I'm just not seeing it. Like a lot of this story dragged, dragged way too long, like way too long. Do y'all remember that time where we had like actual killer clowns out here? You know, it was really people in clown costumes, but they was actually out here catching bodies and there was like warnings about clown sightings. Do y'all remember that time? Freaking wild, right? That was a real thing. If it ever comes back, we'll come back too. All right, so I know what happens during It Part Two. He comes back and they're adults. So I'm assuming It Number Three is gonna be like how he started. It has to be that one. Wait, so everybody's gonna kiss this girl? Like what? This guy's a psychopath. Why are you kissing her with your eyes open? Why am I looking at little kids kiss anyways? Can we speed this up? The movie should be over by now, right? That's literally how the movie ended. <laughs> okay. It chapter one. There it is. Okay, so that was it. Chapter one. It's all right. Let, let's, let's have a talk real quick, y'all. Do y'all really like this movie like that? Like, was there something that I missed? Do you feel like I was watching it with the wrong lens? Let's talk about it in the comment section because I'm curious on what the fascination with this movie is. Cause ah, uh, like I said, if, if I didn't have these headphones on, most of those jump scares, if I would've watched it in theater, it wouldn't have got me. I probably would've been like, oh, okay, all right, cool. Good little moment or whatever. But as far as the storyline goes, it wasn't it wasn't really all that. Like it really wasn't. So I don't I don't know. But let, let's talk about it in the comment section. Anyway, shout out to everybody that current that watched this premiere. I still hope you're doing, looking and smelling great. Thank you all for being here. I hope you guys are enjoying this Spooktober series. Y'all wanted it. I gave it to you, all right? We still got more movies coming this October. We still gotta finish Fear Street. I believe that there's like one more, one more movie left after the one I just did recently. Yeah, I think there's one more movie left. And then after that, we are gonna keep seeing how things go the rest of this month. I appreciate your guys' love and support. Do not forget to hit that thumbs up button. Do not forget to subscribe if you haven't. And uh, until my next movie commentary, I'll see you guys then. Billy Benjes out. Once again, thank you to GlassesUSA.com for sponsoring this video. You guys be sure to use the links that's in the description down below and also in the pinned comment.